Hello, this is Loredana and today I'll show you another upcoming feature for Pipeline, executing graphs on independent WebAssembly binaries. In a previous video, I showed you how Pipeline can be used for creating Rust libraries from graphs. In that case, our Pipeline tools produced source code for a Rust crate, using static dependencies that have to be compiled and included in the final library. This is useful for building libraries of pure functions that you and others will reuse. Now we are using a WebAssembly foreign function interface library to execute a pipeline graph on dynamically loaded WASM binaries. This does not produce an additional library allowing you to execute any graph that uses functions from your WASM binaries. I will be using the same graph as in the previous video with these inputs. Now, we got an error saying that the WASM library used by the graph was not found. So we have to go and compile the library so it can be loaded dynamically. And now we actually have the build for the WASM32 target. So let's run the command again. And we get the result. Now let's uncomment this login command here so we can get a glimpse of what is actually happening. Now we are building the interface for each library and function that we are using in the graph and then loading the library from the provided path and we get to see each step of the graph with the actual function called and the values of the inputs and outputs and then the final result Let's try with some other inputs. And another graph. Soon you will be able to create graphs allowing for more complex operations on top of your independent Rust or WASM modules. Thank you for watching, check out our other demos and subscribe for more updates.